I am Amir Balumbingan, a Youth Solidarity for Peace volunteer and a Young Peace Fever awardee of 2020. My story is just one of the million stories of peace advocates. That's why I challenge you to be kind and to always believe that you can be. Assalamu alaikum mga katimangharan. Ako hi Iman Marwa ay pandangan ang incoming first year college student of the University of the Philippines, Manila. Sambir, ang buka ko mga Youth Solidarity for Peace, Volunteers, and Young Peace Weaver Awardee of 2020. Misan kita ha pandemic piya un, in kita kabataan mataud man jari mahinang. Suway so kita magtawang-tawangi ha pagpaparayaw sing kaumanta. Tawagun na to katanin iban na to kabataan. Inspire, act, engage, empower. Inin hinangon ta bat ing kasiyasahan malugay na nato kabayaan majatuta. Mataw din nagbabayta na sin kita bata hadya. Sa bukon. Tumtumun nato nin kita bata sin kusun. We are youth of great power and powerful voices. Bukun ini limitations nato. Pasal, I am more, you are more, and we are more. Magandang araw! Ako si Amina Sheik Bihalil, isang Youth Solidarity for Peace volunteer at isang Young Peace Weaver Awardee of 2018. Ako ay isang incoming third year nursing student sa Western Mindanao State University. At narito ako upang ipahagi sa inyo kung bakit na rapat namang nakasama sa usapin pang kalikasan ang usapin pang kapayapaan. Global warming, patuloy na pagkakalbo ng mga pundok at pagkamatay ng ating mga karagatan. Ang kalulasunos na pagkasira ng ating kalikasan ay nagdudulot ng samot-saring epekto sa pamumuhay ng mundo. Kapag ang ating kalikasan ay patuloy na masisira, ang dudulot ito ng hindi mapayapang pamumuhay sa mga tao. At narito ako upang sabihin na sama-sama tayo sa pagsupo ng pagkasira ng ating kalikasan upang mabawasan natin ang dulo na dudulot ito. Tandaan, ang lahat ay korektado. And together, let's shake peace. I am John Carlo Oboy, a member of Youth Solidarity for Peace and a recent awardee of the Young Peace Weaver 2020. Peace is somewhat intangible, but it's about the process, right? It's about our own disposition towards our incremental successes and little victories towards the process of peace. I challenge you, let's make an impact together. We would like to encourage our women to be more supportive in the development of their community starting from their own families. Now that we are more aware of our stand as women, we realize that we are vital in strengthening our bodies to move forward to brighter future ahead. Assalamu alaikum makaam kahemon. Ako si Fadwa Alimin Muhammad, volunteer si Youth Solidarity for Peace. The Kayo Young Peace Weaver Awardee sin tahon 2020, iban incoming Bachelor of Science in Nursing students sin Western Mindanao State University. In ako magpaosob makaam na suway pasong ta in panganal ta makatilibot ta labi na wat ito pasalan sin COVID-19. Maghati-hati kita iban maglasa-lasa ombo kita mipalanta makasasawan. Tawangan ta in mga aakahunitan iban magpalatag kita kasanangan. Pasalan bangin kita wi magbaya-baya mehe kajatuhan ta makaaahan. You know education cannot be complete without the concept of peace. We could have education uh, without peace, but actually peace is the key factor in actually having quality education because without peace, uh, we might not be achieving the learner's capability of learning to the highest potential if they are distorted or they are being disturbed of an peace situation. This is the only key for us to actually develop our land and to make people live in a harmonious community. Nonetheless, peace education does not only help our learners but also help our communities build among themselves and particularly sharing also the concept of peace education to other people. It's our privilege and honor that uh, peace education has been uh, the primordial program in the Limited City Division and one of the most essential education that we are actually catering now. As a young leader, I am encouraging my fellow youth to keep the fire burning in you, especially in peace building. I am also challenging you to continue your commitment in serving our fellow youth who are not yet active in their participation to peace. Let us guide them to be one of the catalysts of peace. I build, you build, we build. Hola, buenos dias. Yo si Rene Bon Galvez, un Youth Solidarity for Peace volunteer, Young Peace Weaver Awardee 2020. Yon si Gente Estudiante de Universidad de Filipinas, BA Political Science. Para mi, el catalizando paz hindi como si tan tertuna un cuarto de saber que tu mas bueno contra con quien. El deberás camino a aquellos que hindi tan necesita comparación contra con el magaaksyon de otra gente. 
Como un jóvenes, el objetivo ahora es para poner grandeza dentro de cada gente, sino sostener con el cosa talía, siendo el cambio transformacional que está en el corazón de uno y otro. Buenos días a todos. Yo soy Alcalde Rose Purigay de la ciudad de La Mitan, en la provincia de Basilan. La Mitan City is a four-time awardee of the Seal of Good Local Governance. And as a leader, I can say that good governance is the fuel that propels our city to peace and development, and it emanates from the people and government that values citizens' participation, respect for human rights, and the rule of law. Happy International Peace Day! Let's shape peace together! Let's shape peace together! Let's shape peace together! Together, let's shape peace! Let's shape peace together! Let's shape peace together! Let's shape peace together! Let's shape peace together! Let's